Guys, what's up? It's your boy Plasma Let's Cute, and today we're gonna be doing some Duke tips and tricks on how to be the best Duke in Zuba. And this is a lot like King Clink's video, except for I'm gonna be going way more in depth in this video. That's why it's gonna probably be one of my longer types of videos. And hope you do enjoy the video. Now, on to the video. Now, we're going to be going over what items you need. First off, Nitro Bow. Nitro Bow is insane. As you see in this clip here, we were only able to kill that next because we had the Nitro Bow and the Bomb Play. Our next item that is essential to do is, of course, Antidote Shot. Antidote Shot is insane, and it goes like Duke, like bread and butter. As you see in this clip, I was only able to win because my Adrenaline Shot was able to save me there. Now, the next item we need is Vampire Tease, and here's why. As you see in this clip, that crab gets me low, but the only reason I didn't die was because of my vampire teeth when I was doing my no health kit challenge was Duke. Now the last item we're going to need is jungle shoes, and here's why. Duke is a very slow player, so that uh, extra speed boost will help a lot. Now we're going to discuss where you should go in the Zuba map. I would recommend going over here and to the museum. In red, I'm going to show places where you shouldn't go. You should not go igloo, and on right now I'm going to show you why you should not go igloo. Right here, I was in the ice, and I had nowhere really to get speed. So, of course, quickly after I got tagged by that Betsy, I died right soon after. Here's why you should go to the grass, right here. I was able to get those speed boosts in witness of fight. So, I, of course, went to go into it. I got my speed boost, so I was not really worried, because I was able to get away fast. The barrels did really help that I was able to get earlier. And right here, I was attacking the shade. Pretty scary because I only had one health kit. Saw so back there, saw so that Betsy was about to die. He almost killed that Betsy and stole the Jade's health kit. Even God knows I should not have won that fight. But because I was in the grass, I was able to win. Now for some squad tips and tricks for when you're playing big team squads. Okay, you should always have the defibrillator. Mainly because of this clip here. During this very gruesome battle in big teams, I was able to get that res when I normally would not be able to. And now, on to more big team tips. As a duke, is to be a tank character and freeze other players and collect health kits for your team, period. In this long battle, me and my team were barely able to make it out alive. And so we're just going to keep going. And this shows how important that defibrillator can be. There were teams on every side of us. We didn't know what to do. And if you don't have teammates you can play with, always join my Discord server link in the description or join my Zuba clan. Also, the name of it will be linked in the description down below. So you will go that if you want. So join those two if you want to find some teammates and even play with me. And I was super worried here. We were able to destroy that team. And now on to some commentary over solo gameplay. Okay, so now time for some solos commentary. Of course, I want to go for Legendary Guard. And, but this is another good spot. I don't really talk about it here. But this, has a this could almost always give you a Legendary item right here. And there's also normally a couple guards that spawn here. And yeah right here i decide to go roar it. i want to go kill those two because i really want some health kits that's all guards are to me health kits and if you're a health kit that means you're bad please just die i need health kits that was a joke by the way and since there are three guards here i'm gonna be stocked up on full health and full health kits which later on will be insane that nitro bow does really help me in the long run. And so does the vampire teeth. Of course, I'm not at low enough health where I can use vampire teeth. Right here, there's a jade. And I need to go battle it. It's only a level 7, so I do feel pretty confident. This Ollie is another thing that scares me. That Ollie has a knockback spear, which, as you know, I hate fighting against an opponent with knockback spear. And I will never use knockback spear. Because I don't like knockback spear, and since everyone that uses knockback spear is a weird. Here was a very scary battle for me. I didn't know if I was going to survive it or not because of that ollie. 
Snipers deal a lot of damage against Duke. So if you're fighting a sniper, I would be worried. I was able to go kill that Nyx and get a health kit. Uh, Ollie keeps being annoying, so I decided to try to just go rush while the Ollie's going for loot. But then, that amazing Nyx saves my life, so I decided to kill him. Well, I didn't kill him yet, but let's go. Oh, come on. You're so low. All of my items are what helps here. Of course, those jungle shoots do come in pretty clutch. And then when that Ollie was going to go loot up, we were able to get that kill. Now, it's a 1v1 situation in the bottom of a solo like game. The circle has not closed that far yet. But I don't know. It probably will. That's some good bow. Ooh. That's Duke. You can camp, but I wouldn't really recommend camping. Because that's not fun. And if you do want me to do a part 2 to Duke Tips and Tricks or another character <laughs> guide video, please just comment that down below. And right here, you're pretty easily able to get this dub because it's only a level 5. And see you all next time. And peace out please join my zuba clan we have 24 people of course i'm almost always going to be online and join my zuba clan the electro arm and uh, here's a screenshot of it up close so you'll be able to join and see you all next time and peace out Hi, if you're new, please make sure to click the subscribe button and click this other video here. I upload daily awesome content, and you should of course like and subscribe for a chance of winning a shout out by commenting I subscribed, and see y'all next time again, and peace out for the final time.